हेलो एवरीवन आई एम योर होस्ट आयुषी कारा सेठिया एंड वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल पैबली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ यू कैन ऑटो रिप्लाई टू गूगल माय बिजनेस रिव्यूज बेस्ड ऑन स्पेसिफिक कीवर्ड्स सो लेट्स टेक एन एग्जांपल दैट यू आर अ बिजनेस ओनर हु हैज रजिस्टर्ड योर बिजनेस ऑन गूगल माय बिजनेस नाउ यू आर रिसीविंग द रिव्यूज ऑन दोस बिजनेस एंड यू आर सेंडिंग द रिप्लाइज टू ईच एंड एवरी रिव्यू मैन्युअली but sending the reply manually will be a time consuming and a repetitive process so in this particular video we have came up with an amazing automation by which whenever you are going to receive a review on your business automatically a reply will be sent to the review based on specific keywords so it means whenever the customer is sending you a positive feedback or a positive review and the keywords like highly appreciable very happy with your products and services if the keywords matches then a separate reply will be sent and if the customer is sending you a negative uh, feedback and uh, the keywords matches like uh, unhappy with your products and services waste of time or something like that if the feedback is negative then a separate reply will be sent to the review so here we will be using pabli connect to set up this automation so pabli connect is an automation and integration software which will help us in integrating the applications so how you are going to set up this automation for that you need to come to my screen so welcome back to my screen here let us type p a b b l y pabli.com in our browser this is the website of pabli here we have to come to products and click on pabli connect This is the landing page of Pabli Connect. As you are the first time user, you have to click on sign up for free button and you can create your own account in just 2 minutes. And by creating a new account, you are going to get 100 task free every month. And if the task expires, the 100 free task are recredited to your accounts in the next month also. So if you are already a user of Pabli Connect, simply click on sign in. In the all app section, come to pabli connect and click on access now this is the dashboard of pabli connect here we need to create a workflow for that come to this plus sign and click on create workflow now here we need to give a name to the workflow so let us give the name as share multiple response to google my business based on specific keywords here you can give the workflow name as per your requirement and simply click on create now we can see a trigger window and an action window so pabli connect works on the concept of trigger and action trigger means when this happens action means do this so in this particular use case we want to send multiple replies to google my business reviews but for that first we need to create a connection or an integration between your google my business account and pabli connect so that all the reviews are captured over here so let's uh, create a connection for that click on the trigger window and choose the application name as google my business select the trigger event as new review multi location click on connect click on add new connection and click on connect with google my business now pabli connect wants additional access to your google account So let's click on continue and give away the access over here. Authorization successful and now Google My Business account is connected to Pabli Connect just because I was already logged into my Google account. Okay? Now here it has automatically captured the account name as Parampara. And here we need to select the business location. So the business location is Parampara itself. I'm selecting the same Now before clicking on save and send test request first we are going to create a new review in our Google my business account just because after clicking on this option it is going to capture the latest response so I'll move to my business okay so this is the parampara business it is a designer clothing store in bhopal you can find the address also and now we are going to just click on write a review so here i have written a review unhappy with the service provided highly disappointed okay and here i have given just one star rating and now let's click on post thanks for your review so the review is posted now let's click on done and here i will be clicking on 18 google reviews okay and here we can see that our review is posted over here now let's move back to public connect and now we are going to click on save and send test request okay and here we can see the response is received 
and here we can find all the details of the review captured over here okay here we can find the display name of the customer we can find the star rating as one here we can find the comment also that unhappy with the service provided highly disappointed here we can find the uh, date and time okay the time at which the review is posted and here we have got a review name also now here two condition arises first the customer give, may give you a positive feedback a positive review or the customer may give you a negative review also okay for that we are going to just apply a router over here because we want to send the replies according to the uh, reviews what the customer is posting okay so come to this action step and here we'll be choosing the application name as routers so we'll be renaming this route 1 okay i'll just click on the three dots and click on rename and here we'll be giving the name as positive feedback or positive review okay let's click on update and i'll be renaming route 2 also as negative review okay now we are going to click on update so we have set two routes that if the review received from the customer is positive then what should be the reply and if the re review is negative then what should be the reply so i'll just click on this set filter and action steps so because we have got a negative review first let us set route 2 that is negative review so i'm just going to click on set filter and action steps over here now we'll be selecting the label okay come to google my business new review okay we'll be mapping the review name over here and the review comment was unhappy with the service provided okay so if this particular label contains and the value let us give it as unhappy okay if the customer is giving these type of words so here we are going to specify specific set of keywords okay so if the label if the comment contains this value then this particular workflow should run further or let us give it as our or condition also click on this plus sign let us select the label from the trigger as comment once again and if the filter type will be contains if the comment contains poor service okay and i am just going to click on this plus sign or condition once again and this time so let us select the label again from the trigger response that is review comment if the comment contains waste of time so you can add the or conditions as per your requirement i am just adding the three conditions over here that if the comment contains unhappy word or if the comment contains poor service or if the comment contains waste of time type of word then this particular workflow should run further so let's check the condition let's click on save and send test request okay and here we can see the response is received and in the response we have got the status as success message condition is true why the condition is true over here because the label or the review was containing the unhappy word so we have given the value as unhappy and here in the response also you can see that in the review unhappy word is there okay and here also we have given the value as unhappy so just because of this unhappy word is matching the condition here we can find that the condition is true okay so now we are going to send the reply to this particular review okay based on the specific keywords so click on this plus sign add action step and here we are going to choose the application name as google my Re business once again select the action event as create reply click on connect as we have recently created a connection i'll just choose this option that is select existing connection and i'll click on save okay now google my business account is connected to public connect now here it is asking for the review name so we have already got the review name from our trigger response so we are going to just uh, click on this mapping button i'll remove this data from here and come to google my business for mapping and from here we'll be mapping the review name okay and at last we have got the review name and here we'll be adding the reply so i'm just adding the reply as hi and then i'll be mapping the name of the customer hello customer and here i have added a message thank you for sharing your negative experience with us we appreciate every form of feedback thanks for pointing out what we can do better in future we really appreciate your valuable feedback regards team pabli okay so in this way the message will be sent the reply will be sent on the review okay 
and now let's click on save and send test request okay and here we can see the response is received and in the comment the same message is shared okay it is sent on the uh, review so let's check it and i'm just going to refresh it okay and here we have got the reply hi customer thank you for sharing your negative experience with us we appreciate every form of feedback so the same reply is posted on the review okay and in this way we have created route one so let's move back to public connect and let us click on save data saved successfully and now let's click on close so we have set negative review route now we are going to set the filter and action steps for the positive review route and here we have a special feature of Pabli Connect. Okay, I'll just show you what is the feature. Click on this three dots and here we can find clone step option. So whatever the fields or the details that you have added in this particular route will be copied. Okay, so I'm just going to click on this clone step. It is asking clone this route. Do you want to clone all the steps? I'm just going to click on clone. Clone route successfully. And here you can see that the clone route is added over here. Okay. Now, as we have cloned the negative review uh, route over here, I'm just going to delete this positive review. Okay, let us delete this particular route. Why I'm deleting is just because we have got all the steps copied in our clone step. Okay, and now we are going to rename this particular route. And now let us give it as a positive feedback or a positive review route. Okay, now let's click on update. And now we are going to set the filter and action steps. Now this time the uh, label would be same if the review contains and here we'll be changing the values only. Okay. Uh, highly satisfied. Okay. And the second label should be amazing. And the third label should be, value should be great. Okay. So I'm just giving three words over here. So whenever the comment contains highly satisfied, if the comment contains amazing word or if the comment contains great word, then this workflow should run. So we are going to send, uh, click on save and send test request to check the condition. And the condition is false because in the response, we have got a negative review. Okay, but we are setting the rules over here. Okay, now we are going to create a reply also. So we have already created a connection. I'm not going to make any changes. And here the review name will be the same itself. We have already mapped the details. Okay. Now we'll be just changing the reply from here. Okay. So I'm just going to maximize the size. And now I'm just going to change the reply from here. Okay. I'll just delete it. And I'm just adding the reply. As we are so grateful for your kind words. Thanks for sharing your review with us. Regards, Team Pabli. So this particular reply will be sent whenever a review is positive. Okay. And now let's click on save. Data save successfully. Okay. And now let's click on close. And now we have set both the routes that if the review is negative, then a special message should be sent. And if the review is positive, then another reply should be sent. Okay. And it should be based on specific keywords. Okay. The words will be searched from the review and then accordingly the uh, reply will be sent. So now let us check this in the real time that whether our integration is actually working fine or not. For that, I'll just move to my Google My Business account once again. And here I'm just going to post a review on the name of some other customer. Okay. And the review is though not a great fan of Indian dresses, but must say I was impressed by the collection. Amazing collection. Okay. And here I'm just giving five star rating. And now let's click on post. Okay. Now the post is sent. Okay, let's uh, check the post, whether the post review is created or not. Okay, and here we can find the review, though not a great fan of Indian dresses, but must say I was impressed by the collection, amazing collection. Okay, and within some seconds, the reply will be sent to this particular customer. Okay, and here we have got the response. Hello, customer. We are so grateful for your kind words. Thanks for sharing your review with us. Regards, Team Pabli. So in this way, we can see that a correct message is sent or a correct reply is sent to the customer on his review. And in this way, our integration is working fine. Let's move back to Pabli Connect and I'll just minimize all these windows and let us see in a nutshell whatever we have done till now. 
So first we have created an integration between Google My Business account and Pabbly Connect so that whenever a customer is going to place a review on your Google My Business account, automatically the details are captured in Pabbly Connect. Then we have set the routers over here. We have set the conditions that if the review is negative, then what should be the reply? Okay, and if the re review is positive, then a another reply should be sent to the customer based on specific keywords that the customer has posted in his review. Okay, and in this way, we have created a successful integration and we have learned that how we can share multiple responses to Google My Business account based on specific keywords. Okay, thank you everyone. So not just these software applications, you can integrate a ton of applications and automate your business using Pabli Connect. In case of any queries, you can visit our Pabli forum. To check the pricing details of Pabli Connect, you can visit this particular URL. Also the link of Pabli Connect and this workflow is available in the description box. You can clone the same workflow into your account directly. If you really like this video, please comment, share and subscribe. Thank you everyone.